The cold and snow might not be the type of weather you'd hope for at the end of March, but it is certainly helping bring in some much needed moisture after a very mild winter. Kettle Lands Lauren Solik takes a look at how the rain and snow could help area farmers. This doesn't look like your typical spring weather, but for Harold Timmerman, a farmer near Lenox, the moisture is a welcome sight as planting season inches closer. Every year when you spend a lot of money with fertilizer, seed and equipment costs to put a crop on the ground, you're taking a big gamble and you hope that Mother Nature cooperates and gives you some moisture and the proper uh, weather to make everything grow good. Kelloland meteorologist Brian Karstens says the last time we saw any significant moisture was over three months ago. It's been a long time. You really have to go back in the books from last December. That's the last time we had some soaking rain, which seems a little odd to say, but uh, we did pick up some good moisture in December. But really since then, uh, in some of that January snow we had in Sioux Falls, it's been a long lull in a major system here in the region. So it is welcome news. Brian says Right now, we're on the clock when it comes to changing our position on the drought monitor. We need to see some good moisture this spring to help recharge from those dry soils last year. So this storm definitely counts. We'll continue to watch the next systems as they roll into the area by April. And Timmerman will take any moisture we can get, rain or snow. We've got a lot of room in the ground for moisture. I had a gentleman dig a hole for me uh, uh, out in my field here and it was almost 10 foot deep and there was no moisture anywhere down down there so it was dry the entire way so our subsoil moisture is pretty much gone so we need plenty of small rains throughout the year to make things grow lauren solick kello land news timmerman is also the lincoln county emergency manager he says they've seen a few grass fires recently so today's moisture is a welcome sight for helping with fire danger as well well due to